so many people sharing their stories, Val and Tanya. Several state representatives and gun violence victims are speaking out. They want a ban on assault weapons to help prevent any more deadly shootings. They're hoping to pass the Protect Illinois Communities Act. The package was introduced by State Representative Bob Morgan and includes legislation that would ban assault weapons, better implement the state's firearm restraining order law, raise the minimum age to obtain a FOID card to 21, and address illegal gun trafficking. This is the first official hearing on this matter, and we're hearing testimony, as I mentioned, from many survivors hoping to put an end to gun violence. Contina Patterson, or yes, Patterson, was with a group of family members at the vigil on the west side back in October when gunshots rang out and several people in her family were hit, including Patterson. Ten of my family members were shot, and that including three kids. Ages from 3, 13, and 11, the kids. There is an epidemic out here, mm -hmm. a spread of gun violence everywhere. Mm -hmm. My community is still reeling from the Highland Park mass shooting. And communities across Illinois are suffering from the rampant gun violence in their own neighborhoods. Today is the day that we all stand together and say enough is enough. Patterson was hit in the leg, suffered nerve damage. She's walking with a crutch. She wanted to make sure she shared her story in hopes of making a difference. A resolution is also being introduced this morning honoring Highland Park first responders and officials for jumping in to help the victims of the July 4th mass shooting. We did reach out to Republican state representatives about this package. We're still waiting for a response.